Hi, this is Andrew Gadosh, and I am super excited to introduce you guys that don't know Spencer Marshall to our Rookie of the Year uh, with Andrew Gadosh and Associates. We're really proud of, uh, of Spencer, what he's accomplished this year. I wanted to give uh, give Spencer a little bit of airtime here so people can get to know him. I mean, it's kind of a phenomenal story. So tell us about yourself. All right, what's up, guys? Uh, I'm 21 years old. My name is Spencer Marshall. Um, Andrew's newest agent on the, the Andrew Gadosh and Associates team. And uh, I'm a senior at Ohio State University. So the amazing part about this story is that you're talking about a college kid, a senior in college now, uh, started in real estate when he was a junior, uh, has closed over $50,000 a year his first year in the business while he's going to school full time and crushing it, like hitting all the records as we go, which is pretty amazing. So for me, uh, you know, I got into business when I was 21, 22 years old. Like Spencer, I got my license while I was in college, but it's 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 an amazing feat and yet at the same time it's one that i would say runs along with some other characteristics of your life where you just kind of set your mind to do it right yeah it's just something you got to put your mind to i mean i was when andrew first came to me i was 19 years old i was a sophomore in college i was going to be a cfa that's what i was going to do i was a finance major no way fans or butts about it he comes along to me like hey you should look into real estate uh, let me interrupt you for a second here. So I'm going to tell the story how I met him. So he stole a listing from me is what he did. This guy's not even licensed. He's 19 years old. I've got his uh, his grandfather who had a prime listing in Belleburg. I already had a couple of buyers that I thought we could get it sold for. So I'm calling. It's for sale by order. I'm calling, talking to your grandfather. He's a great guy. He's like, Andrew, come on out. Let's, let's meet. So I went over and you know, did the whole listing presentation. I had a great rapport with them. And, and his parting shot was, man, we want to hire you, but my grandson says he can sell it and I'm going to give him a shot. I'm going to give him three weeks to get it sold. I'm like, what is this all about? So sure enough, I said, go ahead, you know, your grandson, whatever. So he goes, goes back. I call him a week later. I'm like, okay, you ready to sit down? Are we, are we getting close here? How's your grandson doing? He's like, well, we already got a full price offer and we're ready to go. So I knew right then and there that I had two options. One is to kind of, you know, hang my head a little bit and walk away or two, find out who this grandson was. So I asked your, asked your grandfather, hey, what's his number? Reached out to Spencer, asked him if he'd ever considered real estate. I just want to know what he did and how he did it. And uh, he went on and, uh, and tore it up, basically. Yeah, I mean, it, it, first of all, a little bit of credit to Andrew here. To get somebody to, to cut their, their grandpa comes to me, my grandpa comes to me, he's like, you got three weeks. I said, what? I thought we were gonna, you're gonna let me sell it, right? Well, Andrew over here had talked him into uh, giving me just three weeks from my own grandfather. <laughs> so a testament to Andrew's uh, sales skills there. But uh, fortunately, somebody came along before he cut me out of it. But uh, I guess you could say the rest is history, right? He got me interested in real estate. Uh, basically, with the one that, uh, that I guess the sole determining to get me getting my license, right? It was something like I mentioned before that I had never considered doing. And uh, Andrew, uh, I mean, obviously I had an interest in it now and Andrew kind of uh, lit a fire underneath me. So yeah. the rest is history in that regard, right? Well, it was interesting to me kind of looking back on that as well is that, you know, had an interest in real estate, I think more or less your interest centered around investment properties, creating wealth in real estate. And then it was pretty easy for me to introduce them to the EXP value proposition which is, you know, obviously being able to create wealth while you're selling real estate and while you're building your own organization within real estate. So I think when we sat down, you know, you were already familiar with the XP stock, the XPI, and uh, had a little bit of understanding about how that worked and certainly valued that opportunity too. So I think uh, the combination of, you know, the sales ability, um, being able to have you know, an awesome brand, I think locally along with the EXP really kind of helped clinch the deal. We are super, super proud. And, uh, you know, I wanted to tell you, I don't know if you knew this, but you know, you are our official rookie of the year. Your right. hardware is going to be coming soon. So, uh, yeah, you know, congratulations on that. I know we called you the rookie because you've always done a great job, but um, you certainly have won that award and we're super proud. Can't wait to see many, many more years of your success. All right, I might be known as the rookie for the next 10 years. So I'll <laughs> let that go on record. Unless somebody else wants to come in and be the new rookie. <laughs> My wife likes his dimples, you know, so hey, that's a good thing. So, so Spencer, thanks for sitting down with us. Uh, we really appreciate it. You know, I wanted to obviously introduce you to the public, but at the same time, I want anybody out there, if you're a young agent or if you're a young person looking to become a real estate agent or even in the sales business and you're contemplating getting into real estate, certainly give us a call. I mean, this is a prime example about how a young guy who has worked hard and just followed the system, followed the, the, 
protocol for what we know works. It's proven, it's repeatable. And he stepped in even while going full-time to school in another city uh, and having this kind of success. So if you guys have any questions, private message us, DM us, get a hold of us. We'd love to talk to you and help you uh, with your career and at least understand what the opportunities are out there. All right, for all you young guns out there that are considering college, maybe you're in college or maybe college isn't the thing for you and uh, you want to you want to consider being your own boss. I was always taught that uh, you go through college and you go and you make 50, 60 grand starting out and uh, it's a perfect world. You got your degree, but uh, then I ran into real estate and now I've been proposed the idea to be my own boss, make my own schedule and make it a lot more than that, right? The sky is the limit. So if this is something that uh, you might consider getting interested in, or maybe you just want to ask me a couple questions, feel free to reach out to me on social media and uh, I'd be happy to answer them.